In this video, I'm going to show you how to disable the standard Windows sound enhancements. This should be your first step if you're having issues programming Edison from a Windows machine. So the first thing we want to do is go into the control panel as I am now. Go up to the top right hand corner and select view by category. This just makes it quick and easy to find the hardware and sound category and click into that. Now when you're in the hardware and sound category, you should see all of the options that I see here. If you're seeing extra options down the bottom here, such as Dell Audio, Dolby Home Theatre, anything along those lines, you may have advanced sound enhancements and you may need to watch another video in this series to turn these off. But for now, we're going to go through and continue because I don't have any of those things. And even if you do, it is a good practice to come in and try to disable the standard window sound enhancements first and see if that fixes the issue. So we're going to go into sound here and we are going to go into high definition audio device. That's the speakers and that is the headphone jack that should be plugged into your computer. This may not say high definition audio device, it may say real tech audio. That is fine as well. We need to click on that and go into properties. And then inside properties, you'll see that we have four tabs. If your machine does not have the four tabs and it only has three tabs or it has extra tabs, you may have other sound enhancements installed. Please check out the other videos in this series to disable those sound enhancements. On this machine though, you can see I only have the four, so I click into enhancements and I just need to click this checkbox that says disable all enhancements. Once again, if your machine only has this checkbox and doesn't have all of these other options, it may be that you have extra sound enhancements installed. Please check out the other videos in the series to disable them. For this machine though, I have the four tabs, I have the disable checkbox, and I have all of the extra settings. That means I have no other sound enhancements installed, and clicking on this disable all enhancements is all I need to do. Now I hit OK to apply all of those settings, and hit OK again to go back to the control panel. And now all of my sound enhancements are disabled, and Edison should program correctly. So there you go, that is all you need to do for a machine without extra sound enhancements installed. Thank you.